macarons and champagne um, oh yes and I forgot to mention today is day three day four honestly I've lost track guys um, we're kind of exhausted by now with the jet lag and with walking around all day yesterday but yeah still enjoying Paris so far so let's go The goods have been acquired and we are walking over to the Eiffel Tower now. We stumbled across this little street market under the Eiffel Tower and bought some souvenirs here. Here we were just on our way to get some falafels and then the sun came out. It was the first time seeing the sun since arriving in Paris so we were super grateful for that. Hey guys, so we just came to this little street here for falafels but the lineup was literally the longest lineup I've ever seen ever for falafels so we actually went to another um, place that sells falafels that didn't have a lineup but now we're just gonna probably wander around here and we're gonna walk and make our way to Le Centre Pompidou it's pretty much what we're gonna do now That's it for day four, guys. See you tomorrow. Good morning, everyone. We are heading to Musée d'Orsay, and we're just gonna walk there. It should be a really chill, breezy walk. So let's do a quick outfit of the day. Sunglasses are from Gentle Monster. Um, my coat is from Max Mara. It's the teddy coat. And then this random sweater from Taobao. And my pants are black skinny jeans from Zara. I just got them yesterday. And 
Shoes are from Celine. And my leather gloves are also from Taobao. That's the fit for today, guys. dark now and we're walking over to Arc de Triomphe. We're gonna take some pictures there. We stumbled across this restaurant that serves seafood and decided to give it a try. It was actually pretty good. And that's it for day five guys. See you tomorrow. Just checked out Rouge and other stories, um, but I didn't really like anything there. So we are going to Cezay now. Hopefully, we'll find some stuff that we like there. So I actually got mild food poisoning yesterday, so we decided to take it slow today and just walk around the Marais area in the third and fourth arrondissement, which is known as the trendy hip part of Paris, with cafes, cozy restaurants, boutiques, and art galleries. I would say it's a great place to check out in Paris. So it just started to rain, and we don't have an umbrella.
We had dinner reservations to one of the best places in Paris that serves faux gras. The food was absolutely amazing, but the waiters were very snappy. But other than the snappy waiters, everything was very delicious. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to check out part one if you haven't already and stay tuned for part three. Bye guys.